Hmm. Are you able to sell anything? Two hundred naira. Chineke. What is going on in this place? Hey. Huh. Economy, economy. I rich like this now. Ha. Nemo. I have gone round. I work out round. All the schools in this area, they are expensive. Mommy, have you gone to um, what's that school? Uh, Stanford? Which one is Stanford? No, big school down the road there. Oh, that's a big school. Hey, <laughs> mkwanya. <laughs> Me that I was dodging it. You see, have I gone there? If by mistake my leg is going near that school, I'll just jump got and pass the park. Ha. That place that looks like where uh, 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 foreigners are, are going to school. It looks too expensive and I can't go there. Mommy, I heard that they have scholarship there. Eh? Mm. Who told you? That girl that used to come and buy eggs. Chica. Chica. Egg. 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 Oh, that girl that comes to buy egg every Saturday evening. Eh? Ne. We just moved here. You're already making friends with people going to big school. <laughs> But is she sure about the scholarship? That's the school she's going to. Yeah. Mm, and that's how she got there. Oh, she too, she's on scholarship. Yeah. I'll, I'll go and ask questions tomorrow. Nothing ventured, nothing yet. Mm -hmm. huh? They cannot flog me for asking questions. Mm, this one that uh, all the time I went, you didn't tell anything. Is it that you use a jabal voice to call people? Well, it's like this place has bad luck, sir. Eh? Mm -hmm. Because I'll move our umbrella to another side tomorrow. I can't sell in this place again. What kind of bad luck is this? 200 naira since how many hours I went. It's like it's a jabot voice you used to be calling customer. That's why nobody was. Um, yes, madam. We offer scholarships to very brilliant students uh, in this institution and um, Sir, you see that that word you just talk now, brilliant. Hey, <laughs> that is my daughter's middle name. Brilliant. It is too much. If to say there used to be pattern on the bread on skull of people, the book in her head will be trying to come out. She'll be holding it with a tape. Ezioko, that's my daughter. She not book too much. Too much. Her own is national emergency. <laughs> Hi, sir. Madam, you are very funny. <sighs> well, I understand. But the thing here is um, we have concluded arrangements for the examination. The examination comes up this weekend, as you already know. So there isn't time. I'll suggest you go for the next batch. Bad man, of bad man, sir. Hold on, madam. Let me explain. Let me explain. The next batch is just its not far from now. Sir, 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 sir. It's like you're not understanding the thing I just said in the rewind that I just said. Nah, 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 nah. Man, come on, boy. This girl knows book. She knows book. It doesn't matter if you bring that exam this evening. She will persist it. She will persist it. The people taking the exam with her, they'll be looking for her back leg. They will not see her. And, madam, I honestly, believe me, I thoroughly do admire your confidence in your child. But the truth is... Um, as educators, we try as much as we can not to put too much pressure on student, on our children. You are an educator for many, many children. So you are trying to do average uh, thinking of how they can do. I am the mama of this one Peking. This is my one eye. I know her inside out. Eh, sir? Anything about her, I can tell you categorically, sir, that today, he made that test today, this evening. She will lick it. She will lick the plate and drop it for you, dear. In short, out of fear of what she will write there, out of fear you will close this exam for the next one month. Ezioku. Ezioku. My daughter will pass it, sir. <sighs> well, um, okay. So, uh, well, I will try and accommodate her. Hi. Yes. Uh, so, um, uh, I'll need you to go to the admin's office. I will call them now that you're coming. Hey, the way you have accommodated me, my Lord and Master Jesus will accommodate your name into the book of life. No problem, madam. Thank you, sir. Thank you, madam. Hey, you please. Go Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, so you can head out now. Let me call them. Hello, okay. Mm. 
Ne mo. Mami. Mm. My visa. <laughs> hey. Jimmy, I hope he's entering the right places. Yes, Mama. Eh? Eh? It's going well. I brought something to support. No, Mommy. I'll keep it here. Later, you will need it. Should I buy I should bring Minara for you. What of uh, I can make her come. I'll put milk and sugar. Out. I don't want, Mommy. I'm eh? fine. Well, so bad. Eh? Okay, let me quickly go back to the shop. Eh? And I have a customer that said it's coming. Okay. Why? Oh? Mm. Why? Bye bye. Mm -hmm. This Sam. This Sam. Jennifer, <laughs> 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 It's 5 a.m. Go get up. It's time for you to read. Oh. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Just get up, get up. Nah. Get up. It's time for you to read. How do you want to pass this exam if you won't prepare? Hmm? Get up. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. sorry ne. get up, oh. Get up, Ngwangwa. Take your book. Take your book, Nne. Take your book. Take, 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 take it all. Hmm. Nne, nne, Ngwangwa, Ngwangwa, Ngwangwa. Okay, Naga. Take your book. I, I will, I will stay awake with you. Hmm. I'll stay awake. Hmm. Are you ready? Mm. See, you've not opened it. Open the book, open the book. Is writing that exam. Hey, hundred percent, hundred percent. Everything that they are asking her, she remembers all of them. She remembers all of them. I say fire. I say fire. I say fire. Ma shut up, shut up, madam. Whoa. Because all your children dropped out of school. You think that I don't know your story? Jealousy. I shouldn't pray for my daughter because she owns them and not doing well. Kabiko, come, come, girl, get it. Hey, this woman has uh, made me put course in this prayer. I'm cursing. Hey, you could forgive me, forgive me. Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, anything that the other students forget, carry it here, mom, and put it on my daughter's head. I say, remember everything. Jennifer, remember everything. Jennifer, remember everything. I comfort fire into that biro that she's holding. Biro of fire. Biro of fire. But what need? 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 Nede, hey, Naga, Ganiru, 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 Ganiru. Okay, guys, round up. You have a few minutes. have been out by now. I thought so too. Mm, maybe you should just call him. Mm -hmm. Not the principal. I don't want it to be as if I'm disturbing them. Maybe I will just go. It's them. Hmm? It's them that are calling. Mm. 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 Sir?
eat if I want to eat. And I tell you what to eat, I'm good for you. I'm so proud of you. And then you want chicken, I'm going to buy me money. Let me buy chicken. Oh, oh. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, come at me, come at me, I'll go. Oh, you know, hey, I'm so proud of you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know that it's very exciting starting a new school. But Biko, I need you to focus on your studies. Mm? Mm. Mm? Don't worry, mommy. I'll make you proud. Mm -hmm. I trust you. Mm. Having friends is not a bad thing. But please choose the kind of friend that you will have. The kind that will make you go higher, not the type that will bring you down. Yes, oh. mommy. I wouldn't join bad friend. It's a mom. This is your clothes, sir. Hey, this is my bottom box. I brought it out for special occasion. The occasion is that I'm escorting you to your new school. Hey. It's not easy. You are going to start attending Stanford Academy. School room in the big man. Oh, Dizzy, everybody must notice me on the road today as I'm escorting you. <laughs> so, what will you now hear when we're entering university? Hey! Every day will scatter. I will tie the burrapa. I will tie the burrapa. I will find high heel and wear. My gene will reach up. Everybody go tell. They must collect. Say my daughter go to university. Well, let me go in this from here. We move to that side. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hey, you. What's it now? I'm tired already. Okay. <laughs> we need to speak to someone to just drop this bag. Ghost, will you come here, my friend? Don't make her repeat herself. Who are you? Um, my name is. I don't Pan. care. Are you new in this school? Talk. Are you a lizard? Yes, I'm new in this school. So you were new in this school and you passed us and you didn't even greet. Oh, sorry. Yeah, greetings, senior. Mm -hmm. Is this perfume? I like it though. It's not meant for you. You can't like it. It's for high class girls. It's not meant for people like you. Exactly. Are you tying a wrapper or is this a skirt? <laughs> it's a skirt. My mommy chose it for me. Oh, your mother gave it to you. Skirt is way too short. She should have made a shorter one though. My mommy gave it to me. <laughs> Take that to SS1A Diamond. Here, yeah, don't let it drop. Don't let it drop. <gasps> Did you say SS1? That means we're going to be in the same class then. Uh, that's good. Pick it. Pick it. Okay. Class. Hope you all have met your new classmates, Jennifer. Yes, ma'am. Please, you all should try to make her feel comfortable in this school. Okay, okay. Did you hear me? 
Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Okay, what's today's date, please? Okay. Okay, from our last class, please, who can tell me what chlorophyll is? For real? Have I not been teaching? Someone that just resumed. Okay, Jennifer, please. Chlorophyll is the green pigment present in all the green plants, responsible for the provision of light to provide energy for photosynthesis. Wow, that's very impressive. Okay. It's for the fact that she just resumed. You all were in this class. When I thought this. Are they? Spit out that gum. Madam, if you won't respect me in my class. Then leave. Get out. Continue. Daddy. Daddy, I had the worst day today, okay? You know, I am exactly having the worst day today. What happened? Mrs. Rose asked me out of the class. Why? What did you do? Nothing. Absolutely nothing, sir. She didn't do anything. She, she just sent out of the class for nothing. Just like that? How dare she do that to you? I want you to tell her to see me in the office immediately. I'm tired of all this complaint about her. Tell her to see me. Okay, Daddy. Okay. So, class, chlorophyll helps the plant to absorb energy from the sun. It's a substance that is responsible for the green colors in plants. Just like... My father wants to see you in his office. Now. I feel so sorry for you and your future.
Her father is the principal. Nobody gets in her way. Yes. What are you doing here? I was just... Shh. Are you new in this school? No. Uh-uh. All these junior students are beginning to grow weight. So, do you think you can just run away from her like that? Wings? In my father's school? Kneel down! <laughs> if it falls down, you are in trouble. Look up. Hey! Don't let that fall down. Look up. To the sky. Yes. Do you understand your place in this school? Look at me when I'm talking to you. Nobody sits at her spot. Ah, she some students have wahala. Why would she sit at that spot knowing it's meant for the clique? Ah, hello, this is a school, Jennifer. The students are allowed to sit wherever they want. And so? This is the principal's daughter we're talking about here. So what? I don't know. See me, I just like them. You better clean your mouth. Listen, those girls are nothing but trouble. Trust me. I just like the way they carry themselves. No? Jennifer, mm -hmm. forget it, okay? They are troublemakers. <sighs> just, just look at what they are doing to her. Ah, who asked her to sit down here before? Jennifer. Jennifer. She must have been fired. Listen, any teacher who gets in the way of the so-called clique gets fired. Are you serious? Yes. I heard Ada feeds her dad with lies. Oh, uh -uh. father and daughter moments. <laughs> Which one is father and daughter moments now? Huh? How, how is this exciting? See, I want to join that clique. Jennifer, I just told you, those girls are nothing but trouble. Shh. I'm going. Going where? I think you go and ask. Jennifer, yes. don't go there. Jennifer, 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 come back. Are you tired? Run off. Put it on my head. <coughs> Drop it here. Thank you. Oh. Nonsense. <laughs> uh -huh. Hi, girls. <laughs> um, it's me. Do Rob. I look like I want to know who you are? Um, I just want to be friends with you, girl. I want to join your group. <laughs> huh. 
do we look like we are in the market for friends? Yes. No vacancy. See, I'm a very Go adorable back person. To where you are coming from? I am an adorable person. You love me, I promise. Miss Adorable. <laughs> 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 I'm nice. Out. Leave! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jennifer, come. Jennifer. Jennifer. I'm a very nice person. I'm an adorable. Do you think we are being lenient with the students? Right. Because why would she walk up to us? You don't understand. Mm. We are being too lenient. Mm -hmm. Increase the tempo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Jennifer. 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 What is wrong with you, huh? I told you not to go to those girls. Now see how they embarrass you in public. And so? I'm not going to give up. Jennifer, Jennifer, what do you mean you're not going to give up? Those girls told you no, loud and clear. And you still want to go back to them? And so what? Look, people who quit never achieve their dreams, okay? Okay, so your dream in this school is to join the, 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 the so-called high-class clique. Wait. Haven't you seen the way those girls carry themselves? Even their perfume alone speaks about their class. Look, I must join that high class clique, whether you like it or not. Jennifer, huh? Jennifer, listen to me. You don't want any trouble, Jennifer. Jennifer! Um, I'm over now. Jennifer. Oh. Um, how, how was your first day at Stanford Academy? It was interesting. Oh, that's good. Um, I saw you hanging out with the high class clique. Yes, that's because I want to join them. Mm -hmm. Well, you're quite an intelligent person. But if you want to maintain that grade, you'll have to stay away from them. Why don't you focus on advising yourself? Um, I don't mean to be, you know, rude. I, I, I was just trying to tell you, like, give you an advice, tell you the ropes around and... So you should channel all that energy into your life. Wait, so all this catching up with me was to put your nose where it doesn't belong? I... Leave me alone. Mommy, mommy. Hey, scholarship has come. Oh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Sit down. <laughs> hey, how was your day? Mommy, you like this. You don't want to eat it. You like food too much, eh? <laughs> Just me something now. Nah. It's here. It's inside that bag. Okay. Let go do now. Wait, ma. Tell me. Eh? Mm. What happened today? Hey, mommy. You won't believe what happened today. <laughs> I made new friends. Hey! I hope they are good girls. Mm, they're very good girls. Yeah. They are in this group like this. They call them the high class clique. High class clique? Mm. Now, this thing is sounding like a, 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 a cult. A cult. Those occult high class mm, clique. Mommy, please don't make me laugh. No, they are no occult people. Mm. That's the name of their group. No, you know I'm concerned because you know that uh, uh, the principal the, of that school, 
They said that you have to maintain good grade for you to keep that scholarship. Yes, eh? And I need you to maintain that scholarship to SS3 because I don't have money for school fees. So. Don't worry, mommy. Eh? I'll make you proud. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Oh. Eh, uh, you're rushing the food. Eh? Take it there. I kept pure water inside there too for you. Hi, girl. I bought snacks for everyone. Do we look hungry to you? Oh, sorry, I just, I thought... You thought what? Huh? Take your leftover and get out of this place. Sorry. Sorry for yourself. Come. What is your problem? I don't want your snacks. Who is the idiot that wrote me a letter? A letter? What, what kind of letter is that? What's in the letter? <clears throat> Dear Adeze, I'm sorry for offering my snacks to you and making you feel insulted. If you would let me join your clique, I promise I would never do anything that would make you feel insulted or embarrassed. Love from your adorable. <laughs> Jennifer, wait, why are you guys laughing at her? That was sweet of her. You shouldn't laugh at people like that, though. Come on, Jennifer. Enjoy the drama. Sweet <laughs> girl. Cry. Come here. The silly girl that wants to join us. Hi. 
Are you still interested in joining us? Yes, yes I am. Why? Um, <clears throat> first of all, I like the way you carry yourself. Then I also like the friendship and the bond between you three. Um, and yes, I like the name High Class Click. It makes sense. So you do anything you take? I'll do anything. You down. You will do anything it takes. Speak. You're not a lizard. Yes. Yes, I'll do anything. Are you very sure? Once you join, you must not do anything that will make her angry. Of course. I wouldn't do anything to make her angry. Stand. Because of your persistence, I'll consider it. Thank you. Thank you. Come back. You have to take care of our lunch. For a month. Is that a problem? Um, no. No, no, no problem at all. And this should be the last time I should see you in that skirt. It speaks nothing about class. Um, sorry. Does that mean that I'm part of the group now? Bye-bye. That was good. Mm -hmm. On what? One month was considerate. <laughs> she really wants to join us. Yeah. Yeah. She has potentials. We're going to save a lot of money. <laughs> oh, I love the school. <laughs> Small town girl with big city dreams. Scholarship in him, the future that gleams. Left the dusty streets for towers of glass Ready to conquer Anything could pass But the lights were blinding The parties got loud Lost in the city dreams turned to a cloud Books left unopened Phone held all night The girl with a future Guys, so this thing very well. A teacher's warnings, a distance refrain. Easy temptations. What happened to your uniform skirt? Um, nothing. I, I just went to cut it small. Small? Small? This thing that is almost showing you a bum bum. Uh, mommy, it's not showing anything, no. This one is better than that one. That one, I was looking like I was wearing wrapper. Everybody was just laughing at me. And it is this part that they will not laugh at? Nobody's going to laugh. This is the one that is raining now. Uh, 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 yeah. This uh, money in my purse is doing somehow. How? As if it's not complete. Did you take money from my bag? Mommy, I uh am -uh now. How can you even ask me this question? How could I take anything from you? If I want money, I'll ask you now. Then who took it from here? I don't know. Maybe you did not count the money well. Since when did I start making mistake and counting money? I don't know. Okay. Okay, guys, meet our newest member. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Wait, you mean you had this boldness inside of you all this while? Yeah. Well, I'm just trying to fit in. Oh, you don't need to fit in, darling. Take it off. Mm -hmm. okay. And then with the button, you don't need the button. <laughs> you answer to no one but me. Mm -hmm. 
Come here. <laughs> and so this is the rule. The pass and they greet you. You respond. You join them. Okay. Do you understand that? Okay. Jennifer, I need to see you. Yeah. I just want to have a word with her. She'll be back. Jennifer, let's go. Jennifer, do you understand what this clique means to you? Do you want to be with the low class girls in the school? Or rather with the high class clique? I want to be with the high class click. Jennifer! Get out. Are you deaf? You heard her. Disappear now. I'm sorry about the way your friend treated you back there. Oh, it's okay. She's clearly not my friend anymore. I... I can be your friend if you want. Really? Yes. Sure. Why not? Why would anyone want to go and join those girls? I guess it's because she's one of their kind. That girl is so stubborn. You have a point. But she's intelligent. She's not even one of their kind. I just, I'm, I'm paying she's falling for all this, really. I kept telling her not to go, but she wouldn't listen to me. I pity her. She has no idea what she's getting herself into. You're definitely right. She has a no idea. And that's what I'm trying to explain to her, but who am I to talk to her? But like they say, you know, experience is the best teacher. She will learn. Yeah, but I hope she doesn't learn the hard way. Mm. True. <sighs> Jennifer. So, what are you doing this weekend? This one is uh, 200. So, this year 1,000 is just the amount. It won't reach for the egg you wanted. Eh? So, go home and bring extra money. Oh? Fine, girl. Yeah. Yeah. You're getting fine every day. Oh? Yeah. Thank hmm? you, ma. Hey, see your chef. Thank you. Bye bye. Hurry up and come back. Oh? Come here, I'm back. Yeah. You still went to school with this year short skirt? This one is not short. This is the normal length. I say normal. What is normal about this? Everybody eh? likes it, John. Everybody. I don't know what you're talking Those about. everybody that liked it must be on colors. Because in our quality with pants, in our audio, no man is she. Yeah, which one is colors now? Mommy, please. Your school allowed you to wear it like this. This is the length of the skirt they allow in my class. Hey! Yeah, we're quite audio. I don't like it, though. I don't like it. I don't like it. So make it nice on parole. There's no food. There. Go to the house and go and cook by yourself. Every time in our job is their food. It's their food. Yeah, give me money. Which money? Go to the house. There are things there to cook. Oh, no Food, spaghetti is what you want to carry to the house. Yeah, look at
If I look under now, I'll be seeing tears. Look at doing so. Look at doing so. Small town girl with big city dreams. Scholarship in him. A future that glimpses. Left the dusty streets for towers of glass. Ready to conquer. Anything could pass. But the lights were blinding. Why is your face like that? Why is your face like that? I need money. Money? Mm. I thought your school was full scholarship. What are they looking for money for? It's for science projects. Science projects? Well, this one that your face is like a goosey that has stayed three days. How much is the money? No, it's three five. It's a... 3,500 Naira! Hey! Are you people constructing human beings in that your science project? Chineke! The 3 5 is what I sold throughout today. Oh. I can't carry all the money and give you like that. I will just give you half. I'll save half. Tomorrow I'll make it up. Oh? Mm mm. Mommy, I can't pay half. If I pay half, they will not allow me to participate. They will not even collect the money from me, sir. I'll give you the money. Hmm? Yeah. <gasps> Thank you. Mm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, bless you. Mm -hmm. You're the best mom in the whole world. And you too, you are the best daughter in the whole world. Just continue making me proud, though. Thank you. Hi. 3,005. Oh, my mommy, what do you provide? You can finish the food, isn't it? My mouth is now bitter. Hi. Instant malaria feeling in my mouth. Huh? It's now as if I'm tasting salt in my mouth um, now. Did you buy the food? Eh? Did you buy the food? Eh? It is a man in Canada that uh, gave it to me. What happened? It wasn't tasting like that in my mouth. It was tasting all right. What do you want? Why have you been avoiding me? <laughs> Do we have any business together? Jennifer, I, I thought we were friends. Friends? <sighs> I'm sorry, we can never be friends, okay? Not in this life or the next life. Bye. Wow. I think you should let her enjoy her newfound friendship. <laughs> so stubborn. Let's go to class. Come on, let's go. I've tried, I've been there. It's okay. Eat anything, guys. Bills on me. Mm. Mm. You are adorable. I told you. <laughs> um, would you mind if I order some more? Why not? Huh? Mm? <laughs> Jenny, Jenny. Hey. So sweet. Okay, back to business. <clears throat> We're going for a party tomorrow night. And Jennifer, mm -hmm. you're welcome. You'll be joining us. Night. Uh, no, I can't leave my house at night. Huh? Do you still want to be a part of this clique? Yes. Well, what am I going to say to my mom? <laughs> Tell her you're going to church. Mommy's girl. I'll call you tomorrow night. You better pick your calls. You have a phone, yes? Mm, I use my mom's phone when I'm home. Oh my goodness. Your mom's phone? Mommy's phone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mommy's girl. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Lord. 
hat. Let's pray before you get me. Jennifer. Jennifer. Uh-uh. Um, Why did you go? I've been calling your name since. Um, I went to the toilet. What is this one you're carrying? Um, it's my dress I took from the line. Outside. You will drop it because let us let us do money in devotion so that you won't be late. Bring my scarf for me. In the morning, early in the morning, in the morning, I will rise and praise the Lord. In the morning, early in the morning, in the morning, I will rise and praise the Lord. Small town girl with big city dreams, scholarship in him, a future that gleams, left the dusty streets for towers of glass. Ready to conquer anything could pass But the lights were blinding The party's got loud Jenny Are you okay? What? What is it? Uh, nothing, I, 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 I saw you crying, I was just walking Obina, can you for once in your life mind your business? Sorry, I... I'm fine, okay? I'm fine, leave me alone. Her teacher's warnings, a distant refrain. Easy temptations, washed away the rain. Friends with fast lives, whispered promises. So, <clears throat> you guys, just see. How was the party? Ah, oh, I loved it. I mean, I had so much fun. Yes, so... <laughs> I danced till I couldn't dance again. <laughs> wait, wait. Um, where is Jennifer? Um, she said she was going to the restroom. And she wants to sleep there. I don't know. <laughs> what is it? Are you okay? I'm okay. You didn't enjoy the party? The guy who took me to the room. He wasn't nice. <laughs> no, no, don't stop, stop, stop. No, stop it. Stop. Sorry. Stop. Sorry. So, um, so, um, we are sorry. <laughs> so, the guy, the guy that took you to the room, he wasn't nice to you at all. <laughs> Oh, so yes. Okay, okay. Egg, two egg. Okay. Uh -huh. My Jennifer. That reminds me. I have been seeing Jennifer with some funny looking girls. Funny yes. looking girls? Yes, sir. Where? The other day at my neighbor's place, there was a party. And Jennifer was there. Hey! hey. Night, oh. It can't be my Jennifer. My Jennifer goes straight to school. From school, she comes here to join me before we go home. It's not possible. Uh -huh. Welcome. Welcome. Mm -hmm. This is my customer is saying that uh, 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 she saw you at party with the funny girls. Party? Eh? Eh? Me? Uh -huh. <laughs> ah, Mama Jennifer. Does Jennifer have a look-alike? Or oh, Abby? I don't know what Jennifer looks like again. I saw her now. It's not me, so... Jennifer, Biko, please. It's like bad people are still putting eye on you. Mm. Come and go home. Go, go home, Biko. They don't want it. just go out. Come and say to you. Mama Jennifer, huh? I know what I saw. I saw Jennifer. She was there. Yeah, well, yeah. What is the color of your problem? Ah, please. Thank you. Come on, be going. Thank you for your patronage. Ah, 
seeing me now. Thank you for your patronage. But I've not even bought anything. Thank you for thinking of buying something. Come and be going. Carry your bad luck and be going. On one again. Look at the person that is even talking about somebody else going to party. Lena Aroge. You are just moving about, looking for who you carry their husband. No shit. Say about poor Biko. You are looking for, 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 for who to initiate into your group of, of people walking about the essence. Even self, I'm always seeing you walking up and down, coming here to gist with me. You don't have work. You don't have work. Small town girl with big city dreams. Scholarship in here. Future that gleams left the dusty streets for towers of glass, ready to conquer. Oh, can I sit? Sure. Um, <clears throat> I brought this novel as a gift for you. No, I'm sorry, I can't accept that. Um, it's actually an interesting novel. For me to you. Come on. I brought it for you. It's a gift. Come on. Yeah. I... Don't worry. Just I... it's fine. Okay. I... Read it. Get back to me. Hmm? What is your problem? Is it my fault to be friends with you? I don't want your book. Take your book, please. I don't know why this guy is talking to me. Obina, Obina, wait. Wait. Um, I'm sorry about earlier. I don't get it. I mean, why would you let someone dictate your life to you? What's it about joining this clique of girls? Is there uh, anything there? A lot, too. See, since I started rolling with the big babes, all the students in the school respect me. Nobody talks to me anyhow. Nobody talks to you anyhow. Really? That's ridiculous. Look, Obina, if you want us to be friends, we can. But it has to be a secret. Well, Jennifer, I don't want any secret friendship from you. Good. Good. Her teacher's warnings, a distant refrain. Easy temptations, washed away the rain. Friends with fast lives, whispered promises. Lost in the moment, couldn't. <sighs> Jennifer. Don't worry, no one is going to take your scholarship away from you. I've talked to my dad. Are you serious? <gasps> Thank you. Thank you. See? I'm on scholarship too, okay? No matter how bad my grades get, no one is saying anything. Yeah, <laughs> no one is going to say anything. Yeah. All thanks to a Daisy here. <laughs> Thank you for being an amazing friend. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's Thank right. Thank you. <laughs> All right then, we have a party tomorrow. <laughs> oh, my oh my God, I can't wait. And the dress code is white. Okay. The dress code is white. white. And please don't forget to come with your emergency money. You know what I mean. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're coming, right? Yes, why not? <laughs> Do you want? No, I'm fine now. Okay. Mm. I'm okay. Ah, no one says no to her. <laughs> Good girl. Small town girl with big city dreams.
Color ship in here, the future that glimpse left the dusty streets. I need money for another school project. Project squad. Another project. I tell you, I don't know. This one is for biology, and they need the money tomorrow. Yeah, are you not tired of projects in that year school? Project. Mommy, I'm tired though. City school, eh, they don't even allow anybody to rest. Even during our break, they used to be reading up and down, up and down, up and down. How much is it this time? Um, it's 5,000. Is it 5 for what? It's 5,000. She naked now. Hey! My mind is just this. 5,000 with full conscience. Hey! Ne, look, market is dull, oh. Market is dull. I don't have that kind of money to give you. I will give you 3,000. Uh, next week, you balance them. Uh, mommy, no. This biology teacher, I don't think he will agree. Oh. Hey, please beg him. Please beg him. Oh, just beg him. He has to listen to you. Hey, this one should take it easy or not, so. I don't used to pluck money from three now. Nah. Bring the one you have. Let me just use that one. Please leave me first. This thing, Nikuru, this money you called, it's, it's, it's giving me depression. Eh? Um, you've hurt my feelings, Sitas. <laughs> my feelings are, are, are hurt. Mommy. One more, one more, yeah. I, um, we just did this for them, yeah. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more, one more. Just one more, one more. Ah. Mm, good boy. Mr. Anthony wants you in his office. Hmm? Hmm? Mr. Anthony wants you in his office. Yeah. Okay. Small town girl with big city dreams. Scholarship in him, the future that glimpses left the dusty streets for towers of glass, ready to conquer anything could pass. But the lights were blinding, the parties got loud. Lost in the city, dreams turned to a cloud. Books left on the bed. Come in. Oh, madam, good morning. Good morning, sir. <laughs> Please, have your seat. Thank you. How can I be of help to you? I'm here about my daughter, Jennifer Obigwe. Oh, your daughter, Jennifer Obigwe. Yes, sir. I hope she is okay. Ha, sir, I can't answer that question, no, because the way things are going, very soon she will not even see food to put in her mouth, so she cannot be okay. So every day, project, 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 you people are just asking for money, money every day. Eh? I can't breathe, sir. It's choke. It's choking me, sir. I cannot breathe. Uh -uh. Which project are you talking about? I'm not aware of any project that is going on. If there is any project going on in this school, I should be able to call the parents directly. There's project though. Every day project. In short, I'm so afraid of that word now. If I sleep, I used to see it floating in my head. Eh? Uh, Every minute project. And at least people should help us. Those of us that our hand is not strong. At least tell us ahead of time. Those of us are petty traders. You tell us so that we'll be saving the money small, small for this project. Not every minute. You just drop it on our head. Just excuse me. Let me call the class teacher. Yes, sir. Shouting, sir. Spoffat is making the voice loud. Yes, you're talking small, small. I'm sorry that I was shouting. It's Spoffat used to make voice loud. Hello, Mr. John. Is there any project going on in SS1 class? No? Are you sure? Okay. Please tell Jennifer Obigwe to see me at the office immediately. Yes. Uh, madam, as you can hear me, the class teacher just confirmed now that there is no project going on. Yeah. Yes. 
Mm. Does he even know what he's saying? I sat yesterday. Jennifer collected money from me for biology projects. Uh, mother, just calm down. I assure you I'm going to get to the root of this matter. Hey. Jennifer will soon be here, so just calm down. Check this, your teacher. So I don't know why they will say they don't know anything about projects. Meanwhile, money is leaving my pockets every day. Check those of them that are buying new shoes and new things. Let's know whether they're using my money to go and build a house in the village. Nika Gola. Hello, John. I told you. I told you to tell Jennifer to see me in the office immediately. What is happening? You said? She is not in the school compound. She uh, uh. Sir? All right. I will get back to you. Sir? Just calm down. Sir? Sir? Uh, wait. Just calm down. Calm down. Is she warm, Jerry Ball? Hmm? Sir? Where is Jennifer? Can't you talk? Uh, I don't know, sir. She, she's not in school. So where is she? Uh, she and Adeze and her friends left the school earlier today. So where? I saw them sneaking out of the compound this morning, sir. Eh? Sneaking? What are you talking about? Sneak out of the school? Yes, sir. They do that all the time. What? <laughs> Alright. You can go back to your class. Madam, please. They do that all the time. Hey, I don't want to shop I was in the shop thinking everything was alright with my daughter. Madam, just calm down. Like I told you, I'm going to get to the root of this matter. I are still here speaking English. I should calm down. Ow. Madam, listen. You see, my, my daughter is the Adese. Oh. Yes, is the Adese. Your daughter is the Adese? Yes. That you said to be recruiting people for sacrifice. Uh, no, now. Uh, You're a ritualist school. No. Uh, Madam. Where is my daughter, please? Madam, like I told you, I will get to the root of this matter. Please. Ah. You can go home, please. It's a, it's a go where? Go home, Come please. here. I will, I, I, the only eye I used to see is missing. You are telling me to go home. I go now. We are principal. Please. I have become your student. Madam. I cannot go anywhere. Madam, you can't do this now. <laughs> Madam, calm down now. Just calm down. I can't. Your name is not Kana. You are using like children for sacrifice. Uh, Madam, like I, told, my daughter. like I told you, my daughter is also involved in this. Okay. Uh, uh, Madam, you can't. What is Madam, it's not what you think now. It's not what you think now. Which kind of problem is this? No, madam. Hey, come here. Adaize, where are you coming from? Daddy, I am. Adaize, I am asking you. Where are you coming okay, from? Can't you talk? Daddy, stop shouting. I took my friends somewhere to unwind, okay? They were stressed out, so I had to take them out. Oh. You took your friends somewhere to unwind? Can you hear yourself talk? If Jennifer's mother didn't come to the school today, I would have known what you have been up to. Ada is it. Yes, Daddy. How did we get to this point? And what is this nonsense I'm hearing about you? Running a clique in my school. Running a clique? Yes. Just because I have friends that we have common goals. Does, that doesn't make us a clique, okay, Daddy? Don't listen to what anyone is saying to you. You don't expect me to talk to all those girls that they are below me, Daddy. It's, As I yes, Daddy, you're not understanding where I'm coming from. You will be severely punished for this. Now, get out. Get out! I... 
friends. So we won't have friends in school again. I'm not. Why, why would I just have friends? What do you mean? Jennifer. So all the money you were taking from me for projects, it was all lies. Hey, Jennifer. You know how things are for us. You know that I even had to hawk the other day for us to have food to put into our mouth. You know. And you still lied to collect money from me. Hey. If I hear that sorry again from your mouth, I will give you back hand slap. Hey, market has been dull. Getting money now is like squeezing water out of stone. You know. And when you couldn't steal from me, you started lying to get money. Just steal it from your mother. I'm sorry. You are still saying you are sorry. When you did all these things intentionally. If I hadn't gone to your school, would I have known now? You would have continued like this. Draining blood from my body. Draining blood from my body. Is it not better that you are just a mosquito and I don't have a doctor? Sucking blood from me like a vampire. We can't. Hey. That's my customer. That said that she saw you in a party. Was she telling the truth? My customer that I sent out of my shop because I put all my hope, all my trust in a criminal like you. Was she telling the truth? <laughs> so you're not only a criminal, you are shabu. Oh, no. In the opposite school, now I got a party. In a quale. No, you are going to price you, poppy, poppy. Hey, wala bo, wala bo. I want a boy. Why would your mother come to school? I don't know. I don't know who. I don't know why she came to school. Are you daft? What do you mean you don't know? So your mother wakes up in the morning anytime she feels like it and then she reports herself to school. Now, what is this thing about asking her for money for projects all the time? Um, it was money that I used to buy lunch for the girls and yesterday was for the outing. And you couldn't come up with a better lie then? Implicating me and my friends and my dad and now he's mad at me. I'm sorry. Get out. I don't want to talk to you again. Please, please now. Small town girl with big city dreams Scholarship in him, a future that gleams Left the dusty streets for towers of glass Ready to conquer, anything could pass But the lights were blinding, the party's got loud Lost in the city Hey girls. Can I pay for your snacks? You put us in trouble and your best way to apologize is paying for snacks. My aunt almost sent me back to the village because of you. For the first time, my dad raised his hands on me. He has never done that before. 
I'm sorry. You're sorry? What will your sorry do for me? My movements now are restricted from school to house. What does that do for me? What are you still doing here? You're sorry, yes? Hi. Hello. Hi. Mm. Pour her the water. What? What did she do? Go. Go. Jennifer. Jennifer, don't do it. Jennifer. Jen Jennifer! Jennifer, what's the meaning of this? I didn't. So drop the water then. Small town girl with big city dreams. Scholarship in hand, a future that gleams. Left the dusty streets for towers of glass. Chica. Ready to conquer. What happened to you? I did it told Jennifer to pour her water on me. And she did it? Yes. <laughs> Dike, Dike, where are you going? This nonsense needs to stop. Dike, please don't go Chica, and confront them. Dike, Dike, don't go and confront them. Adisi, how can you be this wicked? Eh? Is he talking to me? Do not think that everybody in this school is afraid of you. I mind my business don't mean I am scared of you. Do you understand? How dare you talk to us like that? Are you crazy? Huh? If you try this rubbish with a chica ever again, you will see a side of me you don't like. <laughs> if I try it again, what will happen? Mm -hmm. um, what will happen? Guys, Shut up. Uh, Adizzy, you don't want to know. It's not pushing the game. <laughs> Mr. Andrews, Mr. Andrews, just calm down, please. Don't tell me to calm down. This situation is under control. Stop, fine. I'll close the school. Mr. Andrew, like I said, this situation is under control. The doctors are doing their best to make sure that you're. My safe. son has come. If anything should happen to him, I'll make sure he's brought in jail. Mm -hmm. Clearly. Put me in trouble. Adaisi! How could you? How could you? That school is what is putting food on our table. Now you've ruined everything. Ada! <laughs> you are sorry. You are sorry, Adaisi. How will this story bring back? How will this story eh, help this innocent boy over there? Adaisi. Adaisi. What is my crime? What happened? Why are you doing all this to me? Why? Is it a crime for me to harbor you? What is my crime, I'm asking you? 
I'm highly disappointed in the four of you. Especially you, Adesa. Tony, I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Please forgive. You are sorry. The consequences of your actions extend beyond apologies. I'm very sorry. You are sorry. Now, I want the three of you to go home. Inform your parents that I would like to have a meeting with them. Sir? Yes. Now, leave my office. Sir, please. We are sorry, sir. sir please. I said leave my office. Leave. What are, what, are, what are you waiting for? Are you okay? Hmm. This one that your body has been, you've just been like a ice block since you came back. You don't even want to talk. But the mama. I'm okay. Just fool. You're fool. You. You are fool. Hey. What is the problem? Um, it's not uh, uh, I, just, I just scored 97 in my test today. That's how nice it is. This is my daughter. <laughs> this um, you scored 97. That's why you're feeling bad. Eh? You wanted to get 100. Eh? <laughs> no, you should be rejoicing. You see me, your mother. <laughs> Those days, if I get up to 20, everybody in the compound will rejoice with me. <laughs> I don't have a head for book. Eh? I'm proud of you. This 97 you got is just to jump three steps. One, two, three, year 100. Eh? It's not too much. Did anybody in the class get that 100? I'm sure you are the higher self with the 97 that you are complaining about. Eh? It's okay. Next time you get the 100, oh. You are tired. Hmm? Hmm? You are tired. You are tired. You are tired. Drink water. Drink water. Hmm? You do? Daddy. Daddy, I'm sorry for everything. And I promise that from now on, I'll coordinate myself in school and, and, and I'll follow the rules and regulations. And I promise you won't hear anything about a clique in school anymore run by me. I, I'll be a good daughter too. Daddy. Do you know the extent of what you have done? Those children are going to lose their scholarship because of you. Daddy, please. Please. How does the please now change the fact that DK is still in the hospital? Every morning I go there to see him. My heart bleeds. Knowing fully well that that boy is dead because of my own daughter. Daddy, but I said it was a mistake. It was a... Wait, wait, will you keep quiet? It was a mistake. I might even lose this school. Because of you. A school that I have toyed so hard to build. Because of your character. Ada. Yes, Daddy. I'm withdrawing you from this school. What? Yes. Daddy. I am going to enroll you in a military school where you will be punished for any misconduct. And you will not have me to cry to. I think this tag of a thing that uh, you are the CEO's daughter is what is getting to your head for the first place. Daddy. Daddy, please, you can put me in a military school. Daddy, I'm, I'm, I'm begging you, please. Daddy, I promise I will be a nice person. I'm not going to. Daddy, I'll, I'll, okay, I'll, I'll be the best student you want. I will listen to my teachers. I do my assignment. Okay, Daddy, do you know I swept the house this morning? I cleaned the house. Why would you even put me in a military school? What would they do? Quiet. 
Absolutely. Keep your sorry to yourself. Williams. And that decision is final. Please don't get into I will shout it before I say. Okay, sorry. There was one that swept the house this morning. I cleaned the stairs and I swept the house for one. Daddy, did you not see me sweeping the house? Did you not see me sweeping the house? I swept the house and I was tired. And I was still sweeping it. Did you not see me clean the house? Daddy, we are taking it this morning. I was sweeping. Follow me. I know go gray. I know. Uh -uh. Jennifer. <laughs> Jennifer. What are you doing still lying down here by seven o'clock? Jennifer. What is this now? I say you're lying down here by seven o'clock. Are you not going to school? Mm-mm. I'm not going to school. I have a head day. Head since when did that one start? It just started now, now. Hey. Well, let me come and wear clothes. I'll go to Kemi. Buy you medicine. Oh. Jennifer's classmate. Yes, ma'am. I am. Child. Um, Ma, why, why didn't Jennifer come to school? You didn't see her today. Serious headache. Strong one was what was doing her. Oh. This one, uh, medicine was not even... I just told her to lie down and sleep and rest. Okay. Uh -huh. I'm sorry about that. Ma. Thank you very um, much. Please, tell her I stop by. I will. <laughs> Did anything happen in your school yesterday? Um, how do you mean? Because the way Jennifer came home, ah, we are near them. She was just cold. She wasn't oh. talking. Quite unlike Jennifer, oh. she's always lively. Uh, she didn't tell you. Tell me what, mm -hmm. because there was actually a fight in school yesterday, and DK was seriously injured. Fight? Yes, ma'am. Did Jennifer fight? Uh, she caused the fight. She um, no, no, but but um, she she wasn't the one who caused the accident. It was actually a dizzy. She just pushed DK, and then DK just hit his head on the stone. Is the person still alive? Yes, he is, but I heard he was in a coma. Hey! Chilekenna! Chilekenna! Coma and death, what's the difference? He's not in the mortuary. I'm one more. I'm one more. This girl has finished me. This girl has finished me. Oh, oh, oh. this girl has finished me. Oh, I'm one I'm one I'll, I'll, I'll be on my way now. This girl has finished me. Oh, this girl has finished me. Hey, coma! Has that good for nothing principal been here today? Mm. Mommy. Okay. 
I'll, I'll tell you the truth. Um, I joined Bad Friends in school. This same Bad Friends in the Ogakaland. I pulled your ear telling you not to join Bad Gang. You are just not a head like Agama Lizard. Meanwhile, you had in mind what you want to go there and do. Eh? And people are joining bad friends. You didn't look at your level and look at their level. People that their parents have good money, that they can afford to have bad friends. Even if police carry them anywhere, they can release them that same day. If police carry you now, 100 years you'll be there. I cannot bring us money to do anything for you. You are comparing yourself to those kind of people in work process. You were possessed in the school in the millionaire. You are joining bad friends. Can you afford to have bad friends? <laughs> Tell me about any meeting. Well, there's no problem about that. I called you here to officially inform you about my decision. Like I told the other parents of the other two girls that are involved. See, my decision is not to hinder anybody's progress. My decision is to make sure that Stanford Academy is safe. It's a safe place for everyone for learning. With at least zero tolerance for bullying and unhealthy cliques that is happening in the school. Well, on that note, I just want you to know that they are all expelled from the school. Eh? Yes. I say go. Yes. Listen. Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> My own daughter is also involved. I'm going to enroll her, at least in any other school at all, to serve as a lesson for every student in this school. Sam, please, please let me just ask. What the scholarship? Can we carry it to another school? I am sorry she lost it. Hey! Hey, madam! Hey, madam, don't do that! Madam, don't do that! Can you? Madam, leave! Hey! You need to stop that nonsense! You need to stop that nonsense in my office! You won't do that in my office! What is wrong with you? Madam! No, no, I'm going to get money for school! Please! Please! Please. I know. My daughter is not Madam is Hey. Hi. Um, what, what are you reading? Ah, uh, geography. Oh, okay. What's up? I'm okay. Um, have you gone to check on Jennifer? Jennifer? Yeah. Why should I check on her? 
I, I thought you both were friends. We were friends. Not anymore. She stopped being my friend the minute she joined the clique. Oh, come on. Come on. You, you need to forgive her. I'm, I'm pretty sure she has learned from her mistakes by now. I will think about it. Really. In the meantime, have you noticed how peaceful the school has been since the clique got expelled? Like everywhere is so quiet and peaceful. I'm loving the new school, really. And I, I hope they don't come back. Well, um... <sighs> yeah, so would you like to join me? Uh, no, I'm fine. No, for our test, no? Have you read at all? You should join me. Geography is boring. It's not. I miss you, bro. Why would you come back to school? I have to discuss that with his father. Well, the clique has been expelled, so... And the school has been extremely peaceful and calm since we left. Mm -hmm. Mom, please, can I go back to Stanford Academy? Hmm. We'll have to convince your dad. Convince me about what? Good afternoon, Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Dad. Good afternoon. How are you doing? I'm fine. Okay. Daddy, please, I would like to go back to Stanford Academy. Is that it? Yes, sir. You have to appease the gods. <laughs> appease the gods. Three French hen, two turtle doves. And a patriot in a pear tree. A Christmas carol. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, baby. Uh, Sorry. Does, does that start a yes? Yes. <laughs> uh, coming back to uh, school. Uh, it gets rid of me that <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Big city dreams. Scholarship in hand. A future that glimps. Left the dusty streets for towers of glass Ready to conquer Anything could pass But the lights 